Hey everybody, everybody. Welcome, welcome to the, the Hutch Food, Food Adventures. Adventures. Today we're making mayonnaise. <laughs> Blue, stop it. Go somewhere. No, go lay down. You know how much we love mayonnaise, especially shots full of them. Oh gosh. Yeah, go, yeah. go. Some lady at a Subway told us that you could just make mayonnaise homemade and it's super easy. Yep. So we're gonna give it a shot. Here we go. It's Chef Roscoe today. Got the ingredients. <laughs> <laughs> we got uh, eggs, lemon juice, oil, uh, garlic salt for flavor. What kind of oil? Oh, the extra virgin olive, of course. <laughs> um, a bowl, put our egg whites in. Measuring stuff for whatever reason, I don't use that. A pot and then some ice water. <laughs> the camera's terrible, huh? <laughs> they don't need to see the water. <laughs> so in a double boiler or metal bowl over simmering water. Oh shoot. We That's what I told you, you had to put water in this thing. You're like, nah, nah. Two tablespoons of water? Two tablespoons. <laughs> Two tablespoons. In a double boiler, a metal bowl over simmering water, constantly whisk egg yolks, water, and lemon juice. Woo! Until it reaches 160 degrees or is thick enough to coat the back of a spoon. While stirring, whilst stirring, quickly place the bottom of the pan in a bowl of ice water. Okay, and that's pretty much it, right? Well, no, swipe. Transfer to a blender, add salt and pepper while processing, gradually add oil in a steady stream. Transfer, this ain't easy at all. Transfer to a small bowl, cover and refrigerate for seven days. No, you can up to use it days. up to seven days. So okay. it'll be good for seven days. This is a lot of lemon juice. Two tablespoons? One. I put less than that in my beers. <laughs> I haven't done this in quite some time, separating an egg and all. Let's see if I know what I'm doing. You just use your hand, right? Oh, God. Ugh. Ugh. It feels so... Oh, no. What? The thing. Oh, <laughs> you dropped the whole thing. I dropped just, it. I busted it. Just take the yolk out. Oh, <laughs> This is gonna be so funny. No! That's a Babe, bad egg. you broke it. I told you I broke it. Uh, between you breaking eggs and my camera skills. Your camera skills? You're doing a good job, right? Yeah. <laughs> Round two. Oh, God. <sighs> yeah, there you go. Is the yolk spilling through? Yeah. That's yeah! Good. That's good. Look at that. Yeah. Get on out of there now. Bust through. <laughs> Damn, I oh, separated the that. hell out of this egg. Dang. That's how you do it. I'm That's getting, nice. I'm becoming a pro. All right, time to whisk this Good thing you got those muscles. Yeah. I want to turn the heat up. I don't like waiting. Okay, until it reaches 160 or stick enough to cut the back of the It's almost there. I think it's like this. Oh, okay. Okay. And then when that happens, you're going to place it in a small, in the cold bowl. Yep. And you're going to continue stirring. Okay, let's do it. It's getting thick. It's going in. Continue stirring. Wow, we need a blender. <laughs> this reminds me of when Gordon Ramsay made those scrambled eggs. And so he was putting it on cold and then hot, cold and hot. Egg. We got our whipped egg. We're gonna drop it in to our little blender here. Boop. Here's the egg. We like garlic salt, just a little bit. So we turn it on 
and start slowly pouring in oil, right? Okay. Press the button first. Yeah, I'm scared. If it starts flying everywhere, you guys. Whoa. What's that noise? Is it doing anything? Huh? Is it doing anything? I think so. The motor's burning. So? What do you mean, so? I don't want to get any oil on this shirt. It's don't like a damn that. science project in here. Wow. I'm gonna try it again. Okay. Whoa! What the fudge? Whoa! What the fudge? Why didn't- why weren't you pouring, pouring oil in there? Well, is that gonna make a difference? I don't know, it would've made a difference. <laughs> Try to do it. Oh, okay. Let's go high then. No. Right? Because it's not it's not solidifying. This should look like a scrambled egg batter. We need faster. Here we go. It's nothing. It's so like liquidy. We need more egg, right? No, to it's thicken like two it. Two eggs. Huh? It said two eggs. I was, it was too much damn oil. I think we put another egg in. We gotta save this. We use way too much damn oil to not make this work. Okay, another egg, I guess. Two eggs coming up. Two eggs. Two tablespoons of water. <laughs> Two tablespoons of lemon juice. Let's get more <laughs> Round two. You're just gonna mix it, right? Consistency. Oh lord. It's way too liquidy. Did we cook the egg too much? I think that we just don't know what we're doing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, I pour right. it, pour it in the bowl, and maybe it'll thicken in the refrigerator. Maybe. <laughs> what have we done? Wow. That's nasty. Yeah, it is. It's really nasty. You can see that. Not the, even white. No, it's like yellow from the egg. And you can see the separation of particles from oil and like egg particles. You see it on the top? Mm-hmm. I think we found the error to our ways. We actually don't even really need to add heat to this. So we're over here making a soft scramble, but really, you only apply just a little heat to kill any possible germs that would kill you. So, we're just gonna let this simmer for a few seconds just to murder all those salmonella germs. Okay, <clears throat> I think we're gonna season it this time with some Cajun seasoning. Make some Cajun mayo. I said to pour it very slowly. Little by little. Are we good? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> that like liquidy as hell. Is it, we gotta add a lot more oil. But it just said to keep doing it very slowly so you kind of wear the oil in. It did say you can use a food processor or a blender, but for the sake of the last time we used a blender. Whoa, what the fudge? I think we're gonna try it this way. Going. My arm's getting tired.
I haven't worked out my arm like this since college. Ew! <laughs> you are still so old. <laughs> <laughs> Liquid as hell. <laughs> Whiskey, son of a. <laughs> it's so liquidy. <laughs> the most important thing to do is slowly add small amounts of oil. Take care to do this step correctly and don't rush it, otherwise, the sauce will break. <laughs> I think that we just have to own the fact that this isn't working out for us. It's not. And it's okay. Did we add too much oil off the beginning? I think we legit don't know what we're doing. <laughs> I feel like I'm trying to make a fire. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a man who does not give up. Okay, babe, not, enough, not more oil. We need to give up. We're wasting oil now. That expensive ass extra virgin olive oil. This is bullshit. It's okay. Why won't you thicken? New whiskey. If you're whisking it and it's not doing anything, me whisking it definitely is not gonna do anything. It says that the thickening. Babe, no. This is ridiculous. The thickening agent is because water and oil don't mix. Oh my gosh. Water. I feel like it got worse. Yeah, I think it did. It's okay, babe. Let's just say it didn't work out. Come on. Come on. I got one other arm, though. Babe, look at me. Look at me. Accept it. Accept it right here, right now. That it didn't work out. We have used half a dozen of eggs. Probably more. We can get more. Negative. It's okay, babe. We gotta use this. I am not going to commit suicide. <laughs> what do you mean? It's just liquidy. Still mayonnaise, right? Technically. All right, ladies and gentlemen, there you have it. The look of defeat, <laughs> pure defeat. A man who will not admit if something isn't working. A man who is still whisking, although he knows that it is not ever going to turn into mayonnaise. There this is stupid. it is. The lady at Subway said it was easy. That is persistence if I have ever seen it. What if we wow. have flour? Admirable. We can make flour mayonnaise. All right, ladies and gentlemen, since he won't close it out, I have to. If you make mayonnaise at home and it looks like this, <laughs> you've done something wrong. And unlike Mr. Hutchinson, you need to own it. Hey. If I didn't break that one yolk, we could have retried it again. As he continues whisking, like, subscribe, comment, Share with your friends. Try to make mayonnaise at home. And if you succeed, let us know. Thanks for watching, everybody. The Hutch Food Adventures. <laughs> this is bullshit. Oh, babe, it's so sweet. We're gonna use it. You got me up.